Hi, it's Martin again from Managility. Um, in this video I would like to demonstrate dashboard and analysis options in the new Excel versions 2010 and especially 2013. Um, what we're looking at here is um, one of the most powerful business intelligence front-ends and you've probably already guessed it, um, it's uh, Excel. Here used um, in conjunction with test data um, based on SQL Server and JEDOX for a fictitious municipal authority. Um, as you recommend for any professional business intelligence solutions, Excel is only used as a front end with the data stored on a central server optimized for BI purposes. The underlying database that we're using contains about 12.6 million sample records. Um, on this dashboard, the uh, user can interact now um, in new and quite interesting ways. For example, there's timeline options where the user can select either a particular point in time or um, a combination of time periods. This can also be uh, changed to different levels of details. For example, I can here only take the first um, week of March and as you can see all the dashboard comp components um, automatically adjust. On the right side here we see slicer elements, um, again the users can pick their particular area of interest um, here and, and the dashboard will automatically adjust. What we particularly like in um, Excel 2013 is now the option to do um, drill downs in charts as well. So for example here I can now double click and I'm going down to um, a more detailed level and can, can, can see how um, this developed. For more advanced users there's also the option to um, access the entire data model um, that is used here in the background and um, change uh, particular um, elements and add filters for example in this case here I could swap the average revenue with transactions, see how they have developed um, I can do now things like um, sorting, for example, um, I want to sort by the uh, number of transactions. Now I've got um, sorting here. In addition to the chart visualization, users can also interact on normal reports, um, drilling down into the level of detail that they're interested or changing time periods um, flexibly on the timeline. Finally, these dashboards can also be published um, on the web if you have SharePoint or an Office 365 edition and your users can use them without anything installed um, apart from a web browser. So, we hope you enjoyed this quick demonstration. As usual, please feel free to contact us for any further questions. We've also launched a new seminar series where we'll be teaching you how to create this kind of business intelligence applications. Please check out our website for further details.